Statistics, or more accurately, inferential statistics, is about using a sample of data to try and understand the population. A sample is a subset of a population. A population is defined by the researcher concerning what is being analyzed. It includes every item that meets the definition of the population. Using a sample is necessary because we can never expect to have all the data on any particular variable that we might be interested in. Even if we had a complete population data set, it would be out of date by the time we completed the analysis. It simply takes time to gather and catalog much of the information we might desire. Imagine you are studying migration patterns of fish. By the time you had the data, the fish would be off somewhere else. One can rarely expect to be analyzing data in real time. In addition, using a sample is the only realistic approach if getting the information we want requires us to actually destroy the product. For example, if you are producing light bulbs, the average life of the light bulbs is important. But to sample the light bulbs to find the average life requires us to turn on the bulbs and keep them on until they burn out, and then measure how long they lasted. Doing that for the whole population, of course, leaves you with no light bulbs to sell. This type of problem is common. A third problem is the cost of gathering data. Even the most simple telephone survey of public opinion costs from $25 to $50 per interview. And even in the world of bookkeeping and accounting, where you might think that each and every account and item has been audited, they rely extensively on samples to reach their conclusions in a financially reasonable way. In virtually all cases, we will simply have to be satisfied with a sample.